Hello everybody, McGregor here and welcome back to another episode of Kenshi and today I want to make an arena. Now I've been watching this for a while, It's everything seems to be good. It's slowly starting to level out with the water and all that. Um, I'm, I currently took down some cactus farms. I'm still waiting for them to grab all of this and store it. I'm going to put another building here for um, some of this wheat straw since it should grow better in in one of these hydroponic uh, farms. So we should, it should hopefully be better on our water. So we'll see how that, that works. But today I want to make an arena to help train our people. So to do that, I what I want to do is I want to make a like a a walled off area. Now I originally want to do it in here in the pit, but it's too close to our door. I don't want it that close to our door, so we're not going to use the pit. Instead, we're going to put it here. It's nice, open. There's a mercenary plate there. Huh. But, uh, yeah. So, and we're going to go with just the level 1 walls and all that. Just because, well, they're cheaper, they're lower, that sort of thing. Do a makeshift wall. Let's come up here. No, 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 no. Okay, there, that's fine. So the idea is we will be putting in some prisoner cages in here. You, my friend, are in the way. Okay, let's just do confirm okay, and come back here to continue on with the wall now that he's not there okay and then in that looks good okay and then we'll do interior I want at least this is actually probably too big of an area but oh well I want, let's say, you here, another one here, another one here. There. This way we can put in the prisoners in there. Basically, you have like a prisoner, let them out, you fight them, and then, yeah, hopefully you win. <laughs> so. So that's what's going to go there. It takes up a lot of space, but it'll probably be worth it. And I know these walls are weak. They're not meant to really, you know, hold them back. That's where we'll be moving this guy here. Who have I... You know what? I've been forgetting to feed him. So... <laughs> My bad. So let's speed this up. And how is this going on over here? It's slowly going away. There's so many of them. So much cactus on the floor there. I have also built um, two more wind turbines, wind generators. I'm also currently, I don't know if it's done. Oh, it is done. Eagle Cross. Now why can't you pick it up, Lily? What's wrong? Is it just too big for you? It is too big. Okay, well then let's just put that here. Let's make another one. See if we can get a higher, uh, a higher grade. What's nice about those Eagle Crosses is that they, they have a very, very far range. The biggest problem with them is that they take much more room uh, for uh, for their arrows and all that. Okay, so let's take... Let's take you. And let's pick him up. 
This is why I wanted to keep this guy. There we go. And we are going to put him in the prisoner cage. There. Let's see. Let's take a look at his loot. I might give him a club, like a very, very weak club later on. If he, especially if he starts getting really good at martial arts, because they do progress, they do get better. So, and yeah, we'll, we'll see what that's like for now. Do you have a sword? How is your melee defense? Okay. Don't want to chop off your limbs, but it might come down to that. The wall is also to help uh, prevent people from helping, also. So let's just shut this door. Probably put some lights all around here, too. Is that everything? That looks like that's it. Set him free. He's malnourished. Attack him. He's so thin. Okay, let's pick him up and put him back in. And first aid. Oh, I don't think you have any first aid on you. No, you don't. Okay, we got to make sure that he doesn't die. Let's do first aid. There we go. Why aren't you coming out? There we go. I'm gonna tap out neck. Come out. There. Gladiator fights. I might also try to bring in um, another faction and set them both free. So like him free and somebody else free and see if they fight. I really want to know if, if they actually fight. These guys have been here for a while and this pack bull is the leader. Huh. He's hungry. Oh, the poor boy. Let, let's get him something to eat. Let's give him, where's it, there it is, diarrhea sticks, there we go. I do know, before somebody mentions, uh, that you can put your guys in bed and they won't eat as much when they're sleeping. So I do know about that, but I'm not going to bother with that. Just watching our power. I'm going to need more batteries. And it powers back. Sweet. How's this going? Oh good. That's all that's all done. So let's take a look at our buildings. I was thinking an L house. Right about Oh. I was really hoping I could put it here. You know what? It could go right there. That's not bad. So we'll put you there. That doesn't block anything. That's great. 
let's come to farming and let's put in another well. Let's put it over here. That's where I want it. Here, let's just confirm. Farming. Okay, now I can place it there. Let's put you right about there. Okay, let's take in... You know what? Let's bring this guy in again. And I'm going to put him on block only. And we're going to set him free. Yeah. I don't know if that's helping or not. Doesn't look like it. What if I take away... This sword. Wait, no. He does seem to be getting better. That's why I'm thinking of giving him a, a little weapon. Oh, you're hurt. Oh, that's right, because your limbs get hurt whenever you uh, attack somebody. You know what? Chop them up. There you go. There we go. Let's pick them up. And put them in. Let's open up the door. I have you coming running back. He's our punching bag. <laughs> and offer first aid, which is great because this is going to raise up our first aid also. You know what? Let's have... Let's have your jobs off. Probably... Oh, I want to up, up my skill. So I might just do that with this guy. So I'm using, uh, I don't have it on my back. I'm supposed to be using Claymore. Did I run out? I did run out. That's fine. And what's the another bonus is that um, when I can recruit him, when I'm ready to recruit him, he's going to be even stronger. So that's going to be nice. <laughs> so that's still going up. That is done. Water's still coming on over here. And this will be all of our, our wheat and all that. The entire thing won't be wheat, though. I just like this building better than this one. Are you outside? What are you doing outside? What are you doing? Ah, why is my door open there? I didn't re even realize my, this door was open. We're grabbing these, all this building material out here. So far, the food seems to be going okay. We'll have to see. Um, over here, it's now nearly empty. But the water was the main thing, you know, trying to 
um, balance out. So let's see now. There's a lot of space in here. I can actually move in the entire operation in here. For the alcohol, including the plants. Farming. Oh, I didn't I didn't do the hydroponic. Um I didn't research it yet. Somebody I think has books or Let's take you out over this way. Let's check the bookshelf. Down. Come over here. What's nothing's in there and nothing's in there. I thought I had more books. Doesn't seem like it. You won't have any. I gotta burn a lot of this stuff. Gotta really clean out my junk. You have some books. Auto haul that. You still have those. No, okay. I can't start I can't start doing what I want to do over there yet. How are you doing? Coming along. Oh, I know what's one thing that I have to make. I have nothing for for uh medicine and all that. You know what? I could just put it in here. I should put in more tables and all that. This wouldn't be bad. Let's see. Crafting. Local workbench. Might as well use a building we already have. There. Put you right in there. Oh, and let us do some lighting. It might be just a bit too high. Let's see how well that does. So this is just going to stay like this, I guess, for now, until I can get some more science books. I can... I should be able to make some. I mean, I don't have anybody working on the ink station, and I should do that. Let's have you working on the ink station. What are you working on? You're. That's right, you're the well guy. Let's have you working on the book binder. Oh, that's a labor one. Okay, you do this one. Which one are you? Okay, is the book binder... I don't know what skill it is because it keeps disappearing. Science, okay. And you'll be making those. And also paper. You know what? Actually, instead of you doing this, 
This is the what? This is the paper press. You know what? No, let's keep it. Let's keep it like that. Actually, you know what? No. You're gonna work on the paper press. She is gonna work on this. Uh, it's gonna go down to here. That's a labor one. That's fine. Look at those hands go! Okay. <laughs> That's fine. Now, now we're making our own books. And you, my friend, you are still getting a little bit better. You know what? Let's just slow that down. Am I making long sword? Did I already do the executioner? Yes, I did. Okay, let's turn off jobs. So that's mark two. It's the executioner. Let's go with the mark one, just because it's going to do less damage. Have you come out over here? Let's do some training. Okay, close the door and then set him free and then beat him up. He's not fighting back. That's perfect. And I don't have any medicine. I need to really wait till he actually gets better. <laughs> Let's come back over here. Let's check out the inventory. And let's... Yeah, give us two of these. And then we will come back over here and administer first aid. And then we'll go back to work. I might also give him better armor. Just so that he can take a beating a little bit better. Bounty hunters, gotcha. Okay, and now let's close this door. <sighs> yeah, so our little gladiator arena. So once we can get more people, I'm gonna start you know maybe putting in some more cages all around um, and then we can do more and more training might even have some people just sitting here you know in case something goes wrong and maybe we will actually have different factions fight against each other in the little arena and that's what I want to see because I am sick in the head <laughs> Let's see, so we're still making all these long swords. These long swords are actually for these guys up on the walls. That's why it's open. You guys busted it down so you could come in and protect him. You guys keep doing that. And that guy's dead. He was a city hero. Got shot. Oh, in the spine. But yeah, so far the same place is coming along nicely. Where are you going? Water. Okay, that's fine. Uh, ink is being made. Water is the problem there. Making paper. 
And yeah, we're making the ancient science book. Let us actually you turn off that. I don't want you researching the engineer stuff just yet because I need the science ones for this. I need one more. Actually, do I even have that here? Nope. And you? No. You go back to work. And how is this going? Did you finish this? It's high. Sweet. Yeah, 174. So this actually sounds very cool. That that that's far. For uh for instance, if you're wondering, boxes, who is using a Mark One. Range is 92, while this is 174. Just to give you an idea of how far uh, that these guys shoot. Well, Mark II, make some Mark IIs. Rangers are more close range, but they, they shoot a lot faster. The uh, Eagle's Cross takes a long time to reload, five seconds. What's this one? This one's 4.4, .4, Mark 4.4 to 8, Mark 2, yes. Let's make a Mark 2. And let's just inventory. These junk bows shoot pretty fast, too. I have thought about giving these guys up here bows, but I figure there's no real point because everybody who reaches them are normally in close combat with them anyways, and the swords I'm giving them actually have a... Um, a defense bonus. I know it has a uh, an indoors penalty, but it doesn't matter because these guys are supposed to be fighting outside anyways, and we don't normally run into robots out here, so nah. <laughs> and these guys are the Countess Katana's the long swords, which I think are pretty good against single units. And these guys don't have the best martial arts anyways, but we do have some in katanas and all that, so. That's why I decided to go with that. How are you doing, my friend? Poopy, really poopy. You are not happy with the situation that you are in. Does our faction thing decrease every time we fight him? Is it the Holy Nation? It is. I think it is going a little bit worse. Oh well. <laughs> oh yeah, you know what? Yeah, let's um real quick. Let's queue up. Bladed club. I'm just thinking just Iron Club doesn't do a lot of damage. Okay, let's do this. Who would be able to do it? Defense. What is your your weapon smith is one. Good. Oh actually. Lily, what is your weapon, Smith? Minus one, even better. Okay. I can tell you to make an iron club. And use it. Where are you going? I 
might even have some in. I don't want a spike club. I could do quarter staff. That was another thing I could do. This to finish and then yeah we'll give it to this guy just to see if the fight's going to be a little bit better and if it will be skilling up a little bit easier okay so let's turn the job off and let's go to inventory here grab that down here I'm gonna grab this kind of come out I have them on block for now let's open this up close it so last time I saw in the minus seven Give you that, set you free. Yeah, okay, it's going up. Ow! It's okay! How is the, our faction relations right now? Minus seven. Let's get Tabath Knack in here. Let's turn off blocking. This up, up neck, just come in here. Let's put them on passive for now. And this is just going to close. It's like he's training me. I wish I could see more of his stats, but I can't. <laughs> tink, tink. What's nice is about uh, the club, it's all temp damage. Like, it's mostly stun damage, so. Trying to bring up our toughness. C73. Okay, yeah, it's going up. Oh, we hit him! Alright, you want to stop this. <laughs> there we go. Pick him up. And put him in there. And first aid. Let 
let's do first aid on ourselves. There we go. And once we get more and more people, it will be faster, you know, to uh, start training us up and all that. I have a feeling that we could just sleep in here. And just go sleep. Watch my food. Yeah, see, it stops. All right severely slows down. And then you... Yeah, I could put you asleep too. Why not? And then you can just sleep in your cage. Isn't this great? <laughs> Alright, well, anyways, guys, that's going to be it for this episode of uh, Kenshi. I'm going to continue, like I said, building this all up and all of that uh, they might have been wanting to heal somebody up yeah but uh, yeah so I'm gonna probably continue training I, I want to get more people like I said for this and maybe different factions so that we can well test things out Is there anything here dead you're dying Blood loss. Oh no, the doggy! We gotta save the doggy. That's important. You. Do you have. Yes, you do. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Close it up and help the doggy. You gonna tell your masters that, that I helped you? I hope so. Alright, anyways, thank you all so much for watching. If you have a like, don't forget that like button and subscribe if you'd like to see more of my daily videos. But yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye.